Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're taking a look at a museum condition Ferrari 308 GTS. In the rear you're going to find what gives this car its name, which is a 3 liter 8 cylinder engine. It's a V8 engine, mid mounted. Behind here you got an actual trunk. Now in 1982 they went to a fuel injection system. Now 83 obviously carried over that fuel injection system, made the car infinitely more reliable. Having only 10,000 miles on this car, this thing starts on the first crank. The 5 speed shifts perfectly. Uh, I mean I did get to take it for a quick ride before it got perfectly detailed. I would bet that there's not another car like this out there uh, that you could replicate this with. The Ferrari 308 was a huge success for Ferrari. They had sold more 308s than any other model to date, and this car continues to be the dream Ferrari of many. Well cared for 308s are getting harder and harder to find, and a car like this one is one of a kind. It's likely that this is the cleanest silver 308 in existence. I can't imagine another like it. With its fuel injected 3.0 liter V8 engine, this Ferrari 308 is covered only 10,000 miles from new, and it shows. The car starts right up, runs an idle smoothly, revs free to redline, and runs cool. The detail of the engine bay makes you question if this car has ever seen rain. The V8 connects to a 5-speed manual via Ferrari's gated shifter. Clutch take up is light, and the 5-speed shifts firmly into gear as you'd expect when factory new. The condition of this car really is spectacular. The glass is all factory original, and thanks to the level of care this car has received throughout its lifetime, all window moldings, rubber trim, and exterior accessories have seemingly survived a time warp. The power antenna works great, as do both exterior mirrors. The headlamps pop up instantly, and there's no warning lights on or other indicators needing attention. With European specification, it's even more of a unique machine. The Euro spec cars were able to bypass US EPA standards, therefore the Euro cars tended to make a bit more power than the US spec cars. Plus, this car is equipped with a 15-inch wheel option that was not available on U.S. cars. Even with its low mileage, you could jump in this car and drive across the country. Add it to your collection or indulge your childhood fantasy in a machine that will depreciate very little, if any, in the future. If you're in the market, don't hesitate. Check this Ferrari out online at dmautosales.com. The front hatch here, you're going to find what looks to be a factory brand new trunk. Uh, you do have the factory spare in here, it is a steel wheel with the smaller mini size spare. The washer fluid reservoir here looks brand new, the, re the radiator, uh, both cooling fans look brand new up here. You can see the Ferrari stamp right there from the factory, but uh, I mean this car is really, it's that exceptional. This car is a European model, so you weren't hit with the US spec bumpers that came out a whole lot farther. Uh, it's a nice thing, it actually looks a lot more flush and adds to the look of the car. And then you can see these fogs under here with the factory grill, but everything is in almost brand new condition. I mean, there's the most tiniest, tiniest bit of wear along here, but I mean, from three feet away, you can't even see it. Other than that, everything else is absolutely perfect on this car. All across the rear of the car, I mean, it's really an exceptional condition. You've got all the proper badging from the factory through it, quattro valvole, which is four valves. Uh, stock exhaust, you got the twin pipes that look brand new, and then since this is a Euro model, you did get a rear-facing fog lamp. This target top pops right off, actually. It's in excellent condition. Uh, it shells brand new as if it's been even conditioned well, but the seals, everything in the way it fits is still in factory condition. So really, to take this out, you just pull it off, drop it right in its spot right here, and you've actually got a cover that goes right over it that'll actually keep it shielded. Obviously with the exterior being museum perfect, uh, the interior follows suit as well. These seats did get reupholstered. You can tell they didn't spare any expense on the leather because it looks absolutely brand new. It's soft, it's supple. Uh, the interior smells brand new. These carpets even look brand new. You can see my fingerprints and the nice uh, lines that have already been put in by the detailers, but uh, everything works perfectly. Uh, we've got an AM FM Alpine stereo in here with CD. And then if you look at the gauge cluster, all the faces on the gauges look as if they're uh, glass smooth and clean. They look brand new. Just jump in and fire it up. This will just give you an indication of how well cared for. This car's really been with 10,000 miles on it. The car's in neutral. Fuel injection. Fires itself right up. 